Hello fellow mutants, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I wanted to thank you guys uh, so much. Like, those of you who reached out to me after my video where I I named addressing something or addressing an issue. Um, yeah, it's called addressing something and, and the thumbnail is me fighting Kylo Ren. Uh, I, like I said, I want to thank you guys, uh, uh, for the support, uh, those of you has given me support, cause, yeah, I'm frustrated, like I said in the video, which I'll, uh, put a link to that video in the pinned comments down below so you guys can watch that if you so choose to, um, I'm frustrated with this situation, and saddened hurt because um a little recap i won't go to like the full detail because um if you guys want to see you into full detail you guys can watch the video one the one i'll uh post in the pink comment section where um pretty much long story short I don't know what I did wrong. I honestly do not know what I did wrong. But in like I was a part of Chris's uh Nova servers. She's part of Geese and Gamers on um I don't know what I did. Supposedly a person or some people bubble yeah, some people had some issues with me. Again, I don't know what. Nobody brought their issues up with me. And I was kicked. Without even knowing what I did. And I don't even know to this day what I did. Nobody gave, came up to me. Nobody gave me a shot to correct it. Nobody gave me a chance to adjust. But instead, their first thing to do is to kick me out. Like, and... I'm known as one of Chris's biggest cheerleaders, and I am frustrated with this situation because, like, if I don't know what I did, I don't know if I said something that could have offended someone. I don't know if, like, and to that st uh, state stature, I don't know if, like. I said something that I could have worded better that someone else perceived, like, took offense to. But again, that I could have worded better. I don't know if I took a joke too far. I do not know what I did. I honestly do not know what I did. And I was kicked out because who knows why on my end I do not know why and when I asked some people in the from the group I had no response one of them that I was friends with decided to defriend me and there was this other person like some other people but at the time one person that I noticed blocked me and I've noticed like there are a few people that has blocked me from the situation and I don't even know why I did. You guys are seriously punishing me for something that I seriously do not know what I did and you guys did not give me a chance to write whatever wrong I might have done in your guys' eyes. And so yeah, I that does frustrate me. And the fact that no doubt that you guys are, like some of you guys who might have issues with me, are talking shit behind my back where that time you guys been talking shit behind my back could be devoted into at least telling me what I did wrong and potentially giving me the chance to do like correct it yeah that's frustrating as well like typically I don't let that affect me so much but <sighs> which is why you guys probably won't uh, see me stream today because I need to uh clear my mind I am also like a bit a tad bit more frustrated with Krista than I am in like 
anyone who may have an issue with me from her community or Discord because not too long before, she, I, like when she got uh, partnered, I I, I DM'd her, congratulated her on getting partnered on Twitch, and she said thank you. She appreciates my the support I gave given her the past year, and she even mentioned how she loved to get to know me in some of the voice chats. You had you're one of the few people that had the luxury of even getting to know me in voice chats. I try like I I don't do voice chat often. I I'm usually a hermit when it comes to online. I do my streams. Yeah, I do open mics. If people want to uh want me on their channels, I will go on their channels. But for the most part, I'm a hermit. So I do not know what I did. And I even said in front of you, Krista, that I hope if, like, if I get to the stage where the number of subs gets to my head, I want people to call me out. I don't care if they are nice or brutal about it. I want people to call me out. Because calling me out, if I cross that line, will, one, strengthen the trust between you and me, two... By giving me, like, by letting me know, you can see whether or not I will actually, uh, try to adjust for you, which I will. And three, I highly respect people who actually does that to me. If they see that if I, they, like, what I'm doing, they feel it's wrong, calling me out on it. But you guys never called me out on it. And this is like shortly after you said, oh, you appreciate me. How do you, can I, how can you expect me to believe that at the moment? Were you still saying that in the moment because I congratulated you? Or were you actually, were you actually, are you, were you actually appreciative of me? And if you were actually appreciative of me, then why didn't you come to me with whatever issue or issues you had with me? Give me a chance to... Just for you. Especially since I'm known <laughs> as like one of your biggest cheerleaders, Krista. And that's my frustration. And yes, I'm hurt. Because I I've known you since you were Darth Barbie. Which been I've been at least a year, and I think it's been a, le a little bit over a year since I've known you. Like a year and a half to two years since I've been supporting you. I and then one person when another person was streaming that was in, that's in your Discord when I dropped in and said hi they told said they added me saying they'll shut the fuck up like what did I do all I said was hi I didn't like I said hi to the person who was streaming I said hi to some people in the chat I didn't even say I didn't even at you and say hi to you. So, what was the cause? And this person was called Cappy. If you guys are wondering. I don't know why I did. Cappy, but he told me to show the fuck up. And I didn't even... I didn't even direct any messages to him. And if you guys... Like, if any of you guys watched this video or the last video, going to Krista's Discord, Twitter... Instagram, uh, Twitch, TikTok, uh, uh, YouTube, or any of her social medias, and harass her because of this, I will call you guys out. I will, because that won't be cool either. And, um, long story short, because I don't want this entire video to be a ranty video, uh, especially since... I feel like it would be a repeat of what I said in the addressing something um, video. Long story short, if you guys have an issue with me, 
I ask you, I implore you. Tell me. Come to me and tell me. You guys know at least a lot of my social medias. You guys got my Discord. I know some of you know my uh, Twitch. I know some of you know my Twitter. I know you guys know my YouTube. Because for the most part, my handle is the same. For the most part, with the exception of Instagram. Because Instagram is different because some people try to pretend to be me. But with, and with all due respect, you guys cannot say that you guys went to me about your issues with me. Because you didn't. You guys cannot say I had knowledge prior or at the moment of what I did to upset you guys. Because I don't. Because you guys didn't, like, before, like, before you, I got kicked. Because I didn't. And I don't. I really don't. You guys never gave me the chance to know so I can adjust. And I respectfully ask you guys to, if you guys can't do that, then don't put my name in your mouths, respectfully. Because you're not, you guys are not giving me the chance to know what I did wrong. Because like I said, I don't know if it's, I took a joke too far, or if it's something I may have said that I rubbed you guys the wrong way, and maybe even that it was a misunderstanding. But you guys aren't even letting me have that chance. Especially to explain my side with whatever frustrations you might, guys may have of me. And yeah, I'm kind of hurt by Carissa because I thought, like, even though I didn't have a chance to talk to her much, I thought we were in a better place. And I thought, hate to use this word, but I had a bit more honor than this. Like, talking shit behind my back. About your issues towards me. But not telling me your issues. And the thing is. Like I said before I uh, officially move on to like the. Before I'm done with this rant. I care about you guys. I do. And I do my best to be a good person. So it's. I it when if you do come to me, if you guys do decide to come to me, which I'm asking you guys to uh, come to me with whatever issues you might have of me, that it doesn't exactly have to be a confrontation because a confrontation, when at least I think of confrontation. Is people fighting, arguing. It doesn't have to be like that. It can be a conversation. With a conversation. Can be where. Well for me in my opinion. A conversation is. Where two people sit down and talk. They both listen to the other side. And they talk things out. Because that's what people do. They talk shit out. If they have a problem. And I'm asking you guys, please, let's talk shit out. I was raised, if I have an issue with someone, tell them. Oh yeah, and keep in mind that uh, after the whole Cappy thing, told me to shut the fuck up, which I don't know why I did. I messaged him saying the same thing, that similar thing, that if you know if you have an issue with me, can always come to me, and he blocked me. That w and I I can show you guys screenshots too if you guys need them. I mean, saying that. But I was raised on if I have an issue with someone to, at least have at least one talk with them, trying to talk things out. And, like, keep an open mind to that person's side, but also try to emphasize, or try to relay your side to them. 
in a way that hopefully they don't take in a, a, a way as you're attacking them. You guys didn't give me that chance. So, like, you guys can't say that I knew prior to me being kicked. Because I didn't. And you guys cannot say that you guys had that conversation with me. Because that would be... Without it being a lie. And I'm sorry if you guys hear a train because I live close to the train. But you, like, you guys can't say you t talk to me. You guys can't say that I knew or know because you guys did not come to me and tell me. So I'm asking you guys, please come tell me, those of you who has issues with me. But, um, I want to thank you guys, those of you who, uh, not only watched this video and the last video, but those who reached out to me and uh, see if I was okay cuz th yeah this I've taken this hard I I'm I will not lie I have like which I never try to lie but or I never do lie I should say but I want to thank you guys for who came out, reached out to me and made sure that I was okay because, like I said, this whole situation is rough, which is why I kind of did the whole recap uh, thing, for in case you guys didn't see my I Trusting Something video. It does hurt and does sadden me and disappoint me and frustrate me because I... Thought the people in the uh, that community, in Christo's community, and Christo, if I'm saying people because I don't know how many people has an issue with me in that community. I thought they were better than this. And I guess I was wrong. I, and I'm open, I'm always open to have that conversation with those people who has issues with me. That door will never be shut. Just expect me to also say my side of things. And the reason why I made the last video and why I kind of recap some things from the last video and this video is because I do believe that people should listen to both sides of the story before making an official judgment. Some people might have heard their side, which, again, like I said, I don't know what their side is. But I wanted to bring up my side, too. Especially in case anyone decides to, like, try to twist my words or actions out of context, which, again, I don't know why I did. But, like I said, it can be damn sure if they came up to me, I would have adjusted for them. And if they do... I will, I will at least hear what they say, and I will tell them my side. Try to reach uh, uh, a point where it's mutually beneficial. We don't have to fight. There's way too much fighting in the world. Way too much people that are that rather fight than have that conversation. They rather have, say, some times, like, some cases people are so focused on hurting others, besides doing the diplomatic way. And that's not right. I, I don't know where the whole, like, people not doing the diplomatic way went anymore, to be honest. And immediately that kind of frustrates me. But, um... Yeah, so I want I know this is kind of lengthy. This video has been longer than I initially t anticipated. But I do want to thank you all who came to me. And, um... Made sure I was okay. And those who heard my side. Who took the time to actually hear my side. I really do appreciate you guys. You guys mean a lot to me, and 
please don't change. And um, uh, that part about you guys, because yeah, I do appreciate it. Please uh, don't change that part. And uh, for those of you who has issues with me, you know where to find me if you guys want to talk things out. Again, it doesn't have to be a confrontation. It can be a conversation. It can be. The door will always be open. Some of you guys, like I said, knows my Instagram. You guys know my YouTube. You guys know my Twitch. And I'm pretty sure it's at least a good majority of you guys in that server knows my uh, Twitter. So use it. Please. Please use it. Please come to me. Their issues. Besides not telling me what I did. And keep talking shit behind my back. Because. Whatever I did wrong. In your guys eyes. Do I know they're wrong. When I make things better. And I want things to be better. And which is why I'm leaving the door open for you guys to have a conversation with me. If you guys want to do things, even like in DMs, let's go ahead. If you guys want to me to put up a live stream to have you guys on, so we can have the public to uh, uh to watch us talk things out, I'm willing to do that. I'm willing to put up a live stream if you guys want that. Or to take things DMs. But. I want to in, 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 reiterate. People are in the stream. If any of you guys do. Go into Krista's Discord or any social media. And start harassing her. Because of this. Situation. For me. I will call you guys out. You guys won't be getting my thanks. I will call you guys out. Because even though you guys might have, might be trying to defend me, going after Krista and her community will not make things better. Like, in terms of, like, in an attacking way. If, if you guys are going to attack her because of my, or, or her community because of my frustrations at the moment with them, then I will call you guys out. And I'm not saying that their frustrations is invalid because I believe everybody's entitled to have their uh, feelings. Just how they're going about it, in my opinion, is wrong. This whole situation could have essentially been killed off if they had a conversation with me. It didn't need to go this big, to be honest. And... The last video I made was, the whole intention of that was me to, um, uh, let people know my side. Because I did notice some people were blocking me without getting my side. And I'm aware that some people are harshly judging me without even knowing my side. So, again... Thank you all who came, reached out to me. I really do appreciate you guys. And those who have issues with me, the door is always open to talk if you guys choose to, which I implore you guys to. Because there's no need to have any fighting. There's seriously no need to have any fighting or any feuds. Especially when I'm so open to hearing your guys' side and I just. So, thank you all. Thank you all who watched this video. I will link the other video in the uh, chat for you guys that I'm referring to. So, love you guys. Have a wonderful day. Be kind to one another. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video.